trails fresh. Mislov just left home. You, Mislov? Shh! Hear that? Wolves? No, wild dogs. Yes, more dangerous than wolves. I'm hunting bigger game. The Nilf Guardians the Griffin killed. Where'd you find them? Ah, I see. You a witcher? That monster slayer they's talking about in the village? Mm. I'll show you, sure. But, uh, I gotta kill those mutts before they hurt someone. Will you help? That is, if you don't mind blunting your silver blades on them? Sure. Griffin's not going anywhere. No. Dogs might, though. So step careful now. Come on. These dogs been a problem for a while now? Since the war started. Soldier on the march, he'll stop to rape a woman, strangle her, kill her man for a chuckle, even butcher a cow. But a dog, a kick in passing, no more. So these stray mutts form packs. Too late. Attacked another one. Dieter. You know him? We served at the Lord's Manor together, where the Black Army's encamped now. He was a stable hand, I was the Lord's hunter. But that was before... Well, a long time ago. Sorry. Hope you weren't close. No, not at all. So, can you show me where you found the Nilf Guardians? Greetings. Griffin, know anything about it? Oh, not much. It's not my kind of game. You're his kind, though. Survival instincts are not gonna make you care. I walk silent through the woods. No Griffin can hear me nor spy me.
was here. One lay there, by the stump, headless. The other hung from a branch, guts splayed, stretching down to... Watch out for yourself now. I'll be fine. Not the first griffin I've dealt with. Not likely to be the last, either. Hope you're right. Good hunting, now. Nelf Guardians were celebrating. Griffin interrupted them. God's eye above, Emperor far away. That griffin's a real scourge. Run, Roach. Lost your key, ma'am? No, not me key. Me pan. It's always sat there empty, this hurt. That is, till the night afore the battle. A man arrived, walked right in like to his own. Was standing at me window, peering at the goings on. He must have eyed me, cos next I knew, there he was, coming my way. So. I grabbed me pan for protection, see? But he just asks all polite. Gran, got any birch bark by chance? Lilac berries or even a few coals? Nay, says I. And you must be right daft to pester folk at night with such foolery. But I sees he ain't listening. Just staring at me pan like a magpie at a copper. Lend it to me, Gran. I'll give it back come morn. Was right baffled for what's he doing, frying in the dark. But I've got a soft heart, so I gave it to him. Fascinating story. Any chance you're nearing the end? A dawn, another rode up to the hut. But come morn, only the... Will you help me, dearie? Bring an old widow or a pan. I could never break down that door myself. And in truth, I'm a fear to go in any road. Such a stench wafting out. Me? Sorry, got more important things to worry about. Yeah, even more important than your pan.
run, Roach. Come on, Roach. Last time I blend out. Greetings. A witcher? You see the notice? Hear about the well? A well? First I've heard. They're a problem? Aye. Tis haunted. Has been for a good twenty years. Twenty? So why do you put out a notice just now? Because earlier on we drew our water from the river. But so many corpses floating in it after the battle is turned noxious. My daughter Mandy drank half a pitcher. Felt dreadful ill. Can't keep nothing down. She grows worse by the day. Herbalist claims you fight a fever with drink. And not beer nor cider, but water. Clear, pure water. And where am I to get that if not from the well? But first, the ghost's got to be driven away. And it... This ghost. Describe it for me. Well, it's awful frightening. Awful. I meant, what does it look like? It looks like a woman, but fresh from the grave. Wears a dirty dress, all rags, its skin flaking off its bones, and it howls like it's suffering. Some wraith, or maybe an alp. If you don't wallop it, master, if you don't take care of it, that is, it'll come kill me daughter. I feel for you, but this is my job, so let's talk about my pay. Something not right with the coin. If you could drop your price a bit, I'm sure we'd agree. That settles it then. Fine, I'll help. Where's this well? In Havel. A settlement on the heights. It's abandoned now, no one ventures there on account of the ghost being about. Drive it off. Please.
Pretty damn hot. Mum, don't let us talk to strangers. Hey, Mum. 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 Come on. black, saturated with blood. Move it! <laughs> Come on! Come <laughs> on. 
slow now. Come on, Roach. are older and deeper heavily armored elf guardians probably Griffin's nest. What remains of it at least. Corpse is a couple of weeks old. Still alive when the Griffin brought him here. Took a long time dying. Bones. Horse. Dog. Human. A few months worth. Female. Larvae and her wounds have already hatched, been dead at least a week. Other griffin must be a male. Deep cuts over the whole body. Not a drop of blood on the beak or claws. Didn't defend herself. Crept up on her while she slept. Thick shaft, dense barbs. A royal griffin. Beak tips worn, gray hairs in the coat, ten, twelve years old. Griffins pair off for life when young, male must be about the same age. Explains why the male I ran into was so aggressive. Hunted the Nilf Guardians down here in the forest first, then started prowling the area. Done all I could, should talk to Vesemir. That's it, Roach.
Come on, Roach. The infamous well. Strange. No sign of a ghost. Maybe it only shows at a certain time of day. Those plums are wreaking havoc on my gut. Yes! Of what? Up and smoke! It's raining, it's pouring, and Bromir is snoring. He bumped his head when he went to bed and wanked himself in the morning. Good man. Good man told me about this. Echo Lane head at the game. Not so fast, Roach. I'm poking him, asking. Go, go. This poor man is out to inspect his grain anytime soon. Oh, oh, and and I I say, it was some drowned way off that sat on the thing. Witcher had nothing to do with it. <laughs> yes, what is it, Wolf? Got good news and bad news. Good news first. Captain of the Nilfgaardian garrison knows where Yennefer went. And the bad's that we have to kill the Griffin for him. What else could he want from two witchers? Go on. Tell me what you know. Griffin's abandoned its lair. Gotta make a lure, set a trap. And how's that going? Learn some things. It's a male. Had its nest in the Vulpine Woods. The Nilfgaardians burned the woods down, killed its mate, smashed their eggs. Thought they'd fixed things. <laughs> it's always the same. Instead of sending for a professional, they try to do it themselves, only end up making matters worse. Got the buckthorn. Ought to work like a charm. Powerful scent. More like stench. City boy. Rotting meat, manure, piss, standard smells of the countryside. Remember Tredegor, hunting that zoogle in the trash heap? You spent half the next day bathing, scrubbing yourself. How can I forget? You ever gonna stop bringing that up? <laughs> Fine. If everything's ready, say the word and we'll get to work. I'm ready. No point in waiting. Let's find a good spot to ambush it. Picked one out already, other side of the stream. There's fields and a grove. Plenty of room and far enough so no one will get in our way. Good. Meet you there. <laughs> 